Hunter City where the bums rich yeah. Skyscrapers block the rays when the sun hits Woo. One time coming, niggas run quick. quick By the time a baby walk, he got a gun grip yeah. I was made for this, yeah. I was made for this Woo. I was made for this, yeah. I was made for this He's in control, he has, he's the master of his masters I can do business with you, right? Master's talking to a master, now the master talking to a slave, a sovereign I'm a licensed you your boy Knowledge of God, Hip Hop is Real, Kia Life Productions We back at it again, man, you know, we're one of the world's most respected out here Putting it down, Red Pill in the building, man, Pill, what's going on? Peace to the gods, peace to the family, brother Red Pill in the building, know the ledge Shout out to Blue Pill, KT, Mama Pill Peace. Yo, Red, man. Um, recently, man, you know, the people... Uh, well, I'm going to start off with this, man. You know, uh, I was on Facebook. And, you know, I follow all the brothers that, you know, give good information and is putting us on the dope things. And uh, mm -hmm. uh, I seen on Brother Polite's page, man, where he was uh, being harassed by the police. And he was, you know, abused. Uh, he was saying he was attacked, him and his wife. You know what yeah. I'm saying? And also, even before that, he was showing how PayPal has been, you know... You know, showing fraud accounts of him having all types of crazy shit saying, you know, a lot of people saying Polite been scamming them, scamming them, scamming them. So Polite was able to show that, you know, all these orders of people that's been making him $40,000 worth of money that PayPal saying that he has to collect. You know yeah. what I'm saying? He put out all the numbers out there. He put it for the whole public to view. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I, I thought about Cointel Pro. And, you know, and I thought about things you've been saying for years about divisiveness, people coming to the community. Dividing the community and you know what I'm saying having to be careful because you guys are being watched and you are talking against the powers that be So, you know, mm -hmm. I just wanted to get your opinion on Cointel Pro and just you know the situation that brother Polite is going through right now First and foremost, I want to say to the brother Polite and to his family that uh, we send you love and light from New York uh, The family out here is definitely standing strong and sending you a lot of energy for your unfortunate situation. I'm not 100% clear of all of the details. Uh, in a few minutes, as a matter of fact, mm -hmm. uh, the brother is going to be doing a live stream, either him or his family, so we could get an update. What we were left with was a clip of an ongoing um, narrative or an ongoing um, tragedy or an ongoing um occurrence that has been happening in our neighborhoods and that's police brutality and it has visited our good brother polite in los angeles by the hands of a notorious street gang that goes by the name of the lapd okay um the history and the background and you know the uh the track record of the brutality that the LAPD has been known to enact on not only law-abiding citizens, innocent women, children, and men, but also being able to target and working as policy enforcers for corporate interests and also as mercenaries and also as people who you know, have ulterior motives and agendas that may be forwarding what we may know as these days as white nationalism. I'm glad that they replace supremacy because we've said many occasions the activities, the behaviors, and the agenda that you see going forth have nothing to do with supremacy. It actually points to what we know as inferiority and fear, fear of a black and more messiah. So the fear of a black and more messiah has our brother Polite allegedly or supposedly in a hospital in custody of the LAPD. Like I said, I'm not going to go into detail about what took place because I'm not enlightened as to the facts. What I did see, as did many thousands of people in this amount of time, is a brother got assaulted and he has it on film by Neanderthals, mm. by policy enforcers, by what we know as the LAPD, okay? Not the feds, not anybody else, but the LAPD. So we know that uh, there are other videos going around where the police departments are assaulting our people at an alarming rate, case mm. in point. There's a video with a sister, okay? A black woman 
a black woman is God candidate mm -hmm. who called the police to arrest and have apprehended a Neanderthal who choked her daughter and the police officer who arrived on the scene, the policy officer, subsequently put her under arrest and assaulted her and her daughter That's and abused crazy. them. I believe he tased them. That's all right? crazy. And he was remorseless on code. There's a code that has been taking place right now. And that code was talked about in detail when we met in Brooklyn on October the 10th at Nicholas and we had a lecture that was entitled Fear of a Black and More Messiah. You two brothers were in attendance. Mm -hmm. I could just go through and do a fact check. So many things are happening in one day we're in the quickening so we tend to forget things that happened a few weeks ago let alone a few months ago. That's why a lot of us have to stay in contact with each other not be distracted and build Build meaning take the information that's being disseminated and shared with you as stepping stones and build on top of that. Take the information, do something with the information, not just listen to the information. The information is being manifested in real time. It's not even information, it's prophecy. Or what it may be is somebody being able to peek into the future or look into the narrative and be able to forecast what's taking place. So in that lecture, I'm in that lecture. Not, I'm not even a not even in the lecture. In that, uh, you know, communication or that transmission, I'm forecasting events that will be coming to pass. Keep in mind. Mm -hmm. Keep in mind for the record. That's why I like to do things on dates so we could timestamp the information. So when we go back and research it and review it, whether it's tomorrow or 2,000 years from now, you're like, wait a minute. He was talking about Trump in October on Columbus Day about the fact that what you're about to see is going to reflect that Columbus Day manifesto. What are you talking about, Red Pill? What I'm saying is what you're seeing right now is the mobilization of what is known as Christian Dome. Christian Dome is a conglomerate of Neanderthal, European nation, nation states, cor um, corporations, uh, tribes, clans, families, all kind of things who are coming together under the um, the banner of Christian Dome to defeat what they see as the great evil and that is the Muslims or the Moslems. Code word Moors code word blackamores, code or code or word nigga, code code word negro, uh-huh, <laughs> and color, code and code and words, African American, code code word thug, code word nigga, nigga with a A, N, A, G, G, A, all that. That's what they're talking about. So they are preparing to rise up as a, a, a collective in the name of their Christ. They have a different Christ hmm. than you have. If you haven't figured that one out, well, there's remedial courses. Mm -hmm. You understand? There's places where you could get this information. Our brother Polite has multiple uh, books and things of that nature where he can enlighten you as to, you know, a different perspective about that whole thing. Mm. But they have a different Christ. They have a different God or God. They have a different entity. They have a different deity mm. that they are feeding. Mm -hmm. This deity is being fed. He's been fed so much. He's been fed so much. He's a, he has, the plate is so full mm -hmm. that this deity now has gained power. And you're seeing that beast becoming unleashed on the people who are acting as if this shit is coming out of nowhere. Huh? Mm. What the fuck was going on, niggas? Huh? How? How the fuck you niggas is still playing duck, duck, goose? I don't know. You know what I mean? Niggas is still in the white me pen. Hmm. Really? Well, do you think any of this has to do with um with with him organizing the gangs and him you know doing what he's been doing in Baltimore, feeding the homeless, organizing the gangs, getting the gangster? You know what I'm saying? Is that such a threat to the government or to, you know, when, when the gangs organize? Is that really, you know what I'm saying? 
when we when we talked about Cointel Pro, you just asked me about Cointel Pro, yeah. and I, I I was building about you know what we see taking place, but in the lecture we broke the Cointel Pro down to coin, right? Because mm -hmm. I you know it's counterintelligence operations and all that. People you know they get a program counterintelligence. They be like, get it right, Cointel. No, okay, well we're gonna do a. We're gonna reinterpret Cointel Pro. We're gonna decipher that Medunetter. Okay? <laughs> the new Cointel Pro is coin, as in a regular penny, a coin, all the way to a Bitcoin. So that's all currencies. You're covering all bases. Coin. <laughs> and then tell is telecommunications. That's everything that we're doing. Smartphones, the motherfucking satellites. You understand your mm. laptop, your computers, the the waves, the ELF waves. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Pro, Cointel Pro, mm -hmm. Pro like the GoPro, the mm -hmm. camera, the mm -hmm. eyes, mm -hmm. that thing right there, that Canon, mm -hmm. that camera, the eyes to the world. That is a magical device right there, and that's surveillance. That's watching you. That's you being in the Truman Show. That's you having millions of people watching you in real time. That's us standing on 125th Street and they put a camera over us that is one of the most technically advanced surveillance cameras on this planet. Not mm. only does it read bio um, uh, metrics, but it also captures metadata in forms of all kind of algorithms. So they're, they're, they're mapping you, scanning you, listening to you, matching your voice. Or, I mean, the shit, it goes deep. So that's your new Cointel Pro. You put all of that together, that's what you see taking place. Mm. A lot of new tactics that are being implemented through the, the, the form of what we find now as modern day technology. So you have social media. Inside social media, all of those aspects of Cointel Pro is playing out, all right? Inside of what we know as conscious community, mixing in with hip hop and popular culture, you're seeing all of that shit play out through Cointel Pro. Conversations is about the coins. Mm. All of the everything's about the coin right now. That's the fallout. It's mm, about the that bag. bag. That's a fact. It's a bag. <laughs> and then that's real. The tell, the the tell aspect of it. You know what I'm saying? The telecommunications things began to go awry when they had the Gemini full moon. That's when Kanye popped up with motherfucking Trump. Mm -hmm. Both of them are Geminis and they popped up on the Gemini full moon due mm -hmm. to knowledge. Mm -hmm. That's miscommunication. Now we're in Mercury retrograde. So the whole thing about the telecommunications, there's a lot of miscommunication going on. Especially now because we're in retrograde. Okay? Mm -hmm. So it's not, it's about not saying it's not about saying a lot of shit it's about not saying a, nothing. Hmm. It's about you're going to have to police what you say come post January 21st because they're going to put an edict out on you niggas tongue they're going to police your tongue. If you don't know or if you don't see that coming I mean god damn it I don't yeah. what you know what I'm saying like no, no, no. they talking we, about even in the, uh in the shutting down in certain aspects of the internet you brought out uh, the fake news aspect fake of news them creating aspect this whole is, that's an attack on consciousness that's an attack on the platforms that's an attack on anything that's going to be subversive or deemed subversive that's an attack on any of the information that they can say, oh, nah, because now with Facebook, if you post an article, they're going to deem if it's real or not. So now they're going to control the course of information because they're going to put fake shit up and say that it's real. Then when you throw in your conscious shit up, which always is going to be a contradiction to what mainstream media is throwing mm -hmm. out there, they're tagging that as fake, subversive, and they're going to even take it further because conspiracy theorists still is committing conspiracy, and that's the shit that the feds is filled up with. Keep that in mind. Don't wow. fall for that one. Conspiracy theorists and niggas that are conspiracy and, and two conspiracy theories is still conspiracy, nigga. Mm. You realize that one right mm. there. So the majority of Trump's followers are on record as conspiracy theorists. He ran his election and his whole movement off of conspiracy theories. He's a known, a globally known th troll. The trolls, <laughs> the, the trolls that elected him are the trolls that went up against the conscious community for the past 10 years inside of chat rooms. Rooms, inside
inside of these motherfucking venues, inside of all of these forums. That's 8chan, 4chan, right? All of these other people, the anonymous motherfuckers who are on, or these niggas are really closet white supremacists on code. There's a lot of things that have been taking place, and a lot of these people know who's who, what's what, and all other things. So, coin, tell, pro, 2.0. <laughs> okay, different shit from what you was Stop already grading. used to, and then they playing in people's brains. Case in point, Kanye, psycho, um, psychiatry, behavior modification, being able to apprehend people, being able to rendition people, being able to deem somebody at 7:30. If you go in the courtroom and you're spitting some of that sovereignty talk, and you're standing on your square, and you're doing certain sort, certain kind of things. They are known to put you into psychiatric evaluation. Then they'll put you on psychotropic drugs. Or they might put attach electrodes to your nervous system by going inside of your brain. Once they do that, you will come out with blonde hair talking about, I just want to take pictures. I just want to take pictures. That's what they can do to you. That's okay? Crazy. That's called game over, family. Mm. All right? You can't, you know, it's hard to come back from shit like that. So they are going to be implementing a wide scale version of what was practiced in the jail on our political prisoners. God bless all of them. Salute to all of them. Anytime they take any one of our freedom, I told you a year ago, I was here, family. Purgatory, buried alive in Detroit. Turned me into Detroit Red Pill, Wayne County. But I never had a bad moment in there. Mm. Fuck a bad day. I ain't have a bad moment in there because I know who I am. Okay? And I knew that it was a test. Okay? And we're all being tested. And we're all gonna we're all being put to the fire. And we're all being challenged by a power that's greater than any one of us standing here. Okay? Greater than each one of us. They moving these pieces on the puzzle and they are testing us and they are waking us up to realities that we may not realize exist amongst us right now. Mm. But, you know, it's in the music. It's in the cloth. It's in the previous videos that we've done. I told mm -hmm. you before, I don't have, all we have to do is go into the archive. The information has been laid out on the channel the minute we started building. That's right. You know what I'm saying? Everything has come to pass. And what I'm saying is what I foresee and what I projected and what I was able to foretell and what I shared with the family through the fear of a black and more messiah one and two we're about to go and do part three with rich a warm-up we're doing mm. it in norfolk virginia january 28th shout out to my brother mike that's out there bringing us uh, me and blue blue is going to open up with the law 44 the blood monologues okay because mm -hmm. that 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 moon that i was talking about that gemini moon where you saw what you saw our people conforming to power you saw our people being treasonous in the time of war. You saw mind control and somebody who was outspoken and talking about the Illuminati. They're going to come and they trying to come and get me. Get help you. me. Jay don't send the killers for me. And then he gets, he get, he gets um, disappeared. He gets quarantined. He <laughs> gets rendition. Nobody asks to see no footage. Nobody asks to listen to the 9-11. Nobody did any follow-up. None of his fans went to the hospital and just deboed with the kid. You know what I mean? Like nobody in the hospital did no tweets, no snaps, mm -hmm. nothing. He just was gone in the era of cloning and all kind of crazy shit. Then he does the video because the, the unfamous video, he's in the bed with Trump. Mm -hmm. All of them supposed to be mannequins, but the hands start moving. Mm -hmm. Okay, he's showing you. They can clone you. These motherfuckers got all kind of things taking place. That's real. So then he pops up in the building looking like the demolition man. He comes back. He's not yelling. He's not saying nothing. He's calm. There's no cloth in his talk. He's very calm. Mm -hmm. So he got broken. Something happened to our brother that was even worse than what had happened to him prior to that. And the world got to witness that. And that was white that was white inferiority. And that was Cointel Pro telling niggas, listen. Listen. Get your shit together. 
You understand what I'm trying to talk to you about? Yeah. Like, this, listen, man. What we see taking place from what we saw in Harlem with the Hebrew Israelites and the feds running down on that temple mm -hmm. to what we saw take place with our brother in L.A. Mm -hmm. What we saw take place with my brother Blue Pill in 07 in Harlem where they mm -hmm. tried to choke his life out. I remember 12 that. 12 of them. Mm -hmm. And he took them, he, 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 he fought them off for him and he beat the case. Okay? He stood his square. So what we see taking place in all these situations is the fact that we have to fortify our square and we have to take this thing a lot more serious and we have to function as a nation and we have to be um, protected. You know, yo, the ancestors got you. Well, goddammit, let the Manchester get me too. <laughs> Send me the Manchester that's holding the Manchester. Mm. That's what I'm looking for. You know what I mean? We're not doing speculation, Black Jeopardy, or none of that shit. We're doing some. This is this is you know, you uh, we're we're in a different phase of the movement. We're in a different phase of the movie. We're in a different chapter of the book. Mm -hmm. You know, um, I love all my brothers, you know what I mean? And I'll never stand here and tear down any one of my brothers. That's not where I want my legacy to be attached to. You know, I know that we're stronger together than we are apart. Everybody has uh, personalities and energies and everybody's a character in this movie. You have antagonists and protagonists. The antagonist has to exist in order for the protagonist to exist in the movie. So everybody has a part to play. There's uh, the laws of dualities kicking. You know, there's a negative and a positive. There's a red and a blue. So mm -hmm. Trump and the danger and the horror and the potential of genocide, war, holocaust that he represents is uh, matched in, you know, the spark and the rise of the black messiahs, the rise of the superheroes, the rise of the conscious ones, the enlightened ones, the rise of the gods and the goddesses and the star seeds. Of course, you got to be matched by some Dr. Um, Dr. Doom shit. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Of course, you mm -hmm. got to be matched by some shit that look like Hitler on fucking Zannies and Perks. Mm. Mm. You know, so what? Get out your feelings, nigga. You niggas play Doom and motherfucking Call of Duty and all of this other <laughs> shit for long enough. You know what I'm saying? You listen to J you listen to the best of Styles P. You know what I mean? You listen to all of the shoot 'em up, bang bang. You know, but you can't. It's not time to begin to ask questions, and it's not time to you know you niggas is doing the motherfucking you know the sham god look away past. Like no, <laughs> you gotta look at this shit for what it is and decide. Instead of, you know, falling apart from fear, you know what I mean? In fighting, true true romance, the end of Reservoir Dogs. Remember that? Mm -hmm. Yeah. All them niggas was laid out. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you don't want to do bag. that. Yeah, for that bag. You don't want to do that. <laughs> you want to you wanna form Voltron. Hmm. You know, you want to show and prove through demonstrations that we feed in these children knowledge and we got classrooms and homeschooling and computers for the babies and OSHA classes for the streets and you know defense shooting you know training and um, you know uh, disaster training uh, curing AIDS you know what I mean all of the things that need to be done for nation building you know what I mean no, it is that right. time Yo, mm -hmm. man uh, you know also want to ask you man because you know right now is a time in the conscious community where it's like you know it's very shaky I see you didn't really speak too much on it but it was a lot of things going on from you know with Pharaoh and uh, Seti and Sanetta you know internet them pulling out you know Seti pulling out the gun on there Sanetta you know having a secret conversation with Pharaoh and his saying crazy things about Seti's mother just like it just went super out of hand and it went super crazy and for people just you know looking outside in you know, it looks ridiculous because a lot of people, they base, you know, they come and they watch you guys. They hear you guys. They take information. They invest in you guys financially, with emotionally, all types of situations and things like that. What do you say to the people? You know what I'm saying? And we'll, we'll, just what's your thought on the whole situation in itself? You know what I'm saying? Even you and Sinetta seemed like I had a little something, but he apologized to you as well on his live stream the other day. So, you know. I want to say first and foremost to the people that I apologize in the name of what 
you know, consciousness represents, uh, the ideal of what the consciousness community represents, you know, and I'm not saying this from a place of perfection because I have my flaws, you know, I got a lot of shit that I need to work on and, and deal with, and, um, I understand the complexities of the situations that we see taking place around us, you know, in this retrograde, in this time of confusion, you know, in this time of turmoil and transition on many different levels, because it's not only a transition for this president select, you know, there's many different transitions taking place at one time. Mm. So, you know, the best thing that I could say about that whole thing that takes that had took in place that it showed us the you know, ultimately it showed us the need and the necessities for the sit down, for the council, for the code of conduct, for the rules of engagement, and a lot of other things to be discussed. And that will happen, that will come to pass, that is uh, what, you know, what needs to happen. And, you know, that's what I'll say on that whole situation. Okay. And um, it will be discussed in fuller detail and dealt with. Okay. And, you know, and, and, and but sometimes it's good to observe. You know what I mean? Sometimes it's really good to be the observer and just watch mm. as certain things play out in this movie. Okay, okay, okay. And uh, the, the only reason I brought that in because we were talking about COINTELPRO. And, you know, sometimes, like when you were uh, describing COINTELPRO, the new Cotel Pro is niggas telling on themselves, <laughs> or well, niggas setting themselves up for uh, situations. You know what I'm saying through social well, media and things. Yeah, yeah, definitely, <laughs> definitely. If if we would uh, if we were to understand this soldier boy, you know, getting locked up, or <laughs> you know, the 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 100 gang members in the Bronx getting mm -hmm. locked up from Instagram videos and you know. The dude's locked up for the mannequin uh, challenge? Yeah, shit like that. You <laughs> With know. the real handguns? <laughs> exactly. Then we know that they're Cointel Pro and, you know, Cointel Pro people have a, a misunderstanding that that's only targeting what they may deem as black leaders. Well, goddamn it. Well, if that's the case, then them niggas only got to come out twice a year. <laughs> It's not that. Yeah, it's not a, right? that it's many not, black yeah, leaders no, walking yeah. around. Don't fucking patch yourself on the back. <laughs> <laughs> it's not that. They're taking out a messianic force. They're interrupting. You know, they just, it's like how they go f um, shrimp fishing. You know what I mean? How they fish. They're mm. just scooping up the motherfucking bodies. You know what I mean? They're scooping up souls. They're breaking spirits. They're tagging you. They're giving you that slave badge, you know, so you'll be interrupted in your evolution or your transformation or your your, your journey in life right mm-hmm so you know we have to focus on getting ourselves in a position where we are non-dependent on their system mm -hmm. where we are non-dependent on their inclusion into our growth and development, all right? Well, we're not dependent on our transformation, our evolution, and our path of enlightenment on their approval, right? Or even them being our adversaries because we don't have to exist as the gods and the goddesses that we are by having this fucking enemy who we be, everybody <laughs> gnarling at them. <laughs> but then when they come to exist, it's like, <laughs> <laughs> Nobody's biting, yeah. not a barking. Yeah, but when they so in front I would of suggest, them. yeah, I would suggest that you know people start putting into action what it is that they say that they're gonna do because they're still gonna be held accountable for what they said that they was gonna do, That's even real. if they don't do nothing. That's real. Okay, yeah, we waiting for fruits to get bust, you know. Mm -hmm. So I live in the real world. I'm not on some fake ass. You know, oh, oh, no, I'm like, no, if it's work that got to be put in, we'll start working. You know what I mean? If there's some motherfuckers that need to get cooked, well, we need to start cooking. Okay? If the debates need to happen, the debates do need to happen because we coming into a four-year cycle where you're going to have to debate as a black people to stay alive amongst these people who have very well-known um, intentions and very public intentions to purge you. That's crazy. 
everything we talked about hypernormalization we talked about demoralization we talked about all of these KGB Russian tactics being a, a playing a huge role in what it is that you're seeing this is a 30-year propaganda cycle warfare is only a small percentage in the physical realm the most part of that is propaganda, misinformation, all kind of chemical and biological warfare. The chemtrails is warfare. Is is warfare. The motherfucking fake news from MSNBC and Fox 5 and all them other fuck shits, that's, that's warfare. The shit that they playing on the radio where they're telling your two-year-old to twerk it, nigga, that's warfare. The shit that they feeding you in these goddamn uh, stores, the cat, the motherfucking dogs that the Chinese people is feeding you, smiling at you. Stutting on you at the same time, that's warfare. All right, that's warfare. That's how they getting you. All of the things that are making us, uh, our women die of cancer. The fact that they are killing a majority of our women through the medical practices and have black women running around talking about, well, oh well, shit looks like it's about to get real for you, black men. They're killing you on alarming rates. All of that misdiagnosis of cancer and all kind of other forms of cancer shit that you've never heard about. They attributing all kind of diseases to you through the foods, through the perms, through the motherfucking clothes. God damn it Are you serious The abortions The eugenics You know what I'm saying yeah. The motherfucking OB The OBYNs Taking out wombs And all of this other stuff mm -hmm. uh, Cesareans Cutting out women open mm -hmm. uh, it, it is It is rampant The things that they are doing To the goddess To the black woman To the mother of the universe And they are And they have them They have them Under the impression Through feminism And a lot of other programs that they're running concurrently to confuse and to separate our people because they've infiltrated and they've created a wedge between the original man and the original woman it doesn't matter about anything else okay if you're not working on fixing that you're not working on nothing right. so polite as he is needed for his demonstration and what he represents as a family man mm -hmm. you feel what i'm saying and the information and the, and the and the demonstration and everything else has to be in alignment with that and it matches up you know what i mean and there's many other people in our communities we have to uphold and we have to lift them what does it show me what, what we're seeing right now that we got to close ranks family mm -hmm. we can't deal with no shit where niggas got to go ahead and grab choppers in order to go learn something Mm. That's detrimental to everything that we stand for. Mm -hmm. All right, I was in. I remember being a child and being at a Savy lecture in St. Croix. This was like '79, maybe '80, '81 or something. And I remember a man going off. You know what I'm saying? To this day, it's embossed in my memory. It's trauma. So we can't traumatize each other out of this shit. We can't bring about. A certain kind of energy into this community where we have to denigrify ourselves you know what I'm saying mm -hmm. we have to take certain things that, that, that you know we have to give up certain kind of frequencies and certain kind of energies in spite of what we really need to be focusing on and that's some love if it's tough love well let's do that I, that's I'm all for that that's that's the kind of tough love and the pressure that makes diamonds mm. but the shit the bust pipes that's that motherfucker that's missiles and bombs and all of that and like I said we are going to have to face adversaries and yes we're gonna have to debate them either physically intellectually mentally spiritually we got to fortify ourselves. When we, when we were in Atlanta, we did the uh, FACTS initiative, you know, and the people yeah. loved that. And, uh, you know, they definitely, you know, they like the solutions and the aspects of what they need to do. For 2017, you know what I'm saying, are we going to be dealing a lot with the FACTS initiative? And are we going to be putting a lot of these initiatives into place and things of that nature? Yeah. Um, what, I'm, what I'm doing currently is preparing because we're in the winter solstice. It just mm -hmm. came in yesterday. And we're also in what is known as the retrograde. And the more I get in touch with the nature is the more that I realize that I should do what nature does during times of the seasons. Okay. And during the winter season is the time to hibernate. That's what most of the animal kingdom does. In the, the plant kingdom, it actually dies during this time or the majority of it. 
it goes it you know it goes into remission and whatnot mm -hmm. it, it it uh dormant in a sense it's dormant you know what i mean then it then it uh you know it resurrects like the scorpion it rises from its ashes so as we take this time off and fall back into this hibernation this well needed you know i had a great year mm -hmm. the year was wonderful you know i'm not even burnt out i feel great <laughs> you know but it's so much that needs to be done it's uh so many things that uh so many doors have opened up so many opportunities have presented themselves you know so much work uh so many so much work that's backed up you know what i mean it, it's 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 very uh demanding it's very uh I wear multiple hats. There's something that I have to, uh, you know, um, be able to control. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Volunteers and interns are definitely needed and appreciated. That's something that you're going to see more of 2017. The Facts Initiative membership site is going to be complete. That's also going to come with a phone app. So you'll be able to network with people that are within your network from within the app and also from within the site, which is a membership site. I'm mm -hmm. encouraging membership sites because I'm not really, I, I respect the subscribers and I appreciate subscribers. But what we need right now as the building blocks of, nation, of nationhood and nation building is we need memberships. Okay. So we need people that are going to be with us, uh, quality membership. All right, and also quantity, but we look forward to quality first mm. and foremost. And um, what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be able to send information directly to the family by cutting out Facebook, by cutting out even YouTube, and all of these third parties that are beginning to um, be very heavily censoring a lot of the material, a lot of the information, and I just don't want them watching my stuff. Like, I'm not interested in being on a global stage, watch, let, having everybody uh, eat off of the plates that we're preparing for uh, uh, specific people. You know what I mean? Like. Mm -hmm. This cloth talk is not for, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is cloth only. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's black only cloth. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know, we on our <laughs> shit. You know, we could be on ours too. So, I'm just saying that, you know, the facts initiative, if, if, if nothing else, show I'm patient. Like, mm -hmm. salute to everybody that has put us, um, reached, helped us reach our goals in the Indiegogo and and to go fund me crowdfunding i'm learning how to uh apply more skills to our campaigns like i'm interested very much so in crowdfunding i have uh a book that i'm putting together dealing with the whole technology field the evolution will be digitized um that's a lecture that i did but we're putting a book together mm -hmm. to, it's gonna be real wavy it's gonna be real crazy you know what i mean and that's 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 the fallback that's what a lot of things have to you know what i mean there's film that's being done we just finished shooting prince video we Is wrapped up uh, made like for prince? this yeah we wrapped up the made for this shout out to cambada shout out to i am um, shula the don shout out to q butter you know what i mean i got his two young guys in the video my brother's in Q Butters in Brownsville doing monumental things. We're going to take a trip to his studio slash homeschool slash uh, photo studio and everything. You know, the brother's doing things in real time. So that's what I'm encouraging. I'm like, yo, 2017, we're just going to be demonstrating in um, real time. You know what I mean? Yeah, and uh, cool. we're going to be showing people. We're going to be taking trips with the camera. We're going to be doing more pay-per-views. A lot of the street um, lectures that we've been doing or the, a lot of the streets. This ain't even because somebody was like, yo, them niggas be in the streets doing lectures. And I'm like, fam, this is not a lecture. This yeah. is just a build. Like, this is us talking. Like, I'm <laughs> not reading notes or anything. I'm just <laughs> flowing. I'm in yeah. my flow. Like... What I want the people to um, witness is the lectures, the put together presentations. I want y'all to see the workshops, the seminars, Mama Pill, KT the Arts Degree, Blue. You know, we're gonna be focusing on Nota Ledge Media Platform exclusively, putting that back out there. Netflix, that's our streaming service. So it's all coming together. Everything is coming together. So this, I don't have time. I will never be on YouTube arguing with nobody. I'm not about that life. I don't do arguments. I pull up. You know what I'm saying? I don't. I'm not about. 
none of that shit. You know, um, I don't encourage that. I got love for my brothers and my and my sisters. I'm I, I'm here to drag our open enemies. That's, That's what up. I'm here. I, I I pull up on the open ones. You know what I mean? I I exemplify. You know, my Heru Kuti, and I let my sword swing, my shout go, and whatnot. And I'm asking the family out there to be there and support that. Get behind that. Don't just do it with your words. Don't flatter me. Don't gas me up. I'm not with the batteries. I'm a soldier. I'm not a fucking doja. You know what I mean? I don't run on Exxon. You know what I'm saying? I'm a <laughs> Tesla. I run off of energy, electricity. I'm an electric body. So reciprocate, give back. Don't call nobody about me. Don't ask nobody to book me. Come directly to me and my family. Don't give nobody no donation for me. Come directly to us. You know, let's build. So the 30000 for the facts, you know that we're going to have that mm -hmm. in no time. And that's going to get rolling. Then we're going to put put out the uh, membership site for Nota Ledge Media, which will have components of Nota Ledge University, all kind of things um, inside of that. Uh, and we're just gonna keep building, man. Um, so, Phil, man, we yeah, definitely appreciate you as always, man. Mm -hmm. And uh, we definitely want to be a part of it. You know what I'm saying? We definitely want to. Yeah. So, you know, we and let yeah, let the family know. Um, you know what 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 would they want from an event than me uh, and you, Blue. You know what I mean? Both of our platforms, Know the Ledge Media, Know the Ledge, and Kia Life come together and do a um you know let's do it like how smack do it let's do it big you let's know what i mean it. let's do it on stages big stages that's what i'm talking let's about let's pull out some hitters you that's know to talk about. about some solutions let's pull out some people to talk about the future i'm a futurist i'm a historian but i'm also a futurist i believe in broadcasting and um and focusing on a time focusing on the now tapping into the now appreciating the now but being able to forecast for tomorrow, building a better tomorrow, you know what I mean? And in real time with the camera, with the film, you know, with these lectures, with these demonstrations, it's augmented reality out here. Oculus Rift is out here. It's virtual reality. Like, it's time to turn up. Okay. Film, it's film time. We need more films. More fire. More we're, films. We're gonna more people CDs. Go to check you out. Shout bro. out to the family who supported Scorpion Kings. More mm. fire. You know what I mean? Ten project, a ten track project. Fire. Me displaying my art. You know what I mean? Shout out to Cambada. Shout out to Blue Pill. It's, you know, it's selling. It's showing me that we could use the platforms. And I didn't go to Title yet. I didn't go to Apple. I will be going there with a remastered album with two more tracks. I think two remixes and a hidden one. And uh, that's coming real soon. When the vid it's going to be a visual project, two videos. We're going to do a crowdfunding for the mini movie uh, Scorpio King. Yeah, when you take control of your art, when you take control of your culture, facts, food, art, arms, okay, mm -hmm. clothes, culture, technology, transportation, shelter, strategy. So when you take control of the culture and you apply technology to it, come on, you gonna win. They no win they gonna win off of yours. They gonna they about to Disney this shit in a minute. You know <laughs> what I mean? Nah, it's just that uh, you see where it's going. They about to Disney it. You know, so we took our art and I had and I, I'm glad that I did it at a certain age because I have a level, I've reached a level of wisdom and maturity at this age that I didn't have at that other age. So I'm able to talk about certain things in a certain way that, you know, I wasn't talking about before. It's yeah. different. Shit. Yeah, you, you know, you it's got just to different. See shit. Yeah, it's, it's just a difference, a whole nother look. Well, and, um, for anybody who's out there, talents mm -hmm. out there who's seeing Red Pill, they're like, yo, I want to be a part of a movie. I, I, I make movies. I do this. I do that. I want to reach out to the brother. Where could they go to check you out, reach you out, or link up? Before the, yeah, that I would say the app, um, but it's not completely finished yet. So, the best place to reach me, go to the IG, L Filthmore, E L underscore Filthmore, as in my name, Philip Thomas Morland, but it spells out Filthmore. All right. Mm -hmm. These are my sites. Kings County. That's the clothing. 
That's that cloth. It's kingscounty.com and kingscounty.bigcartel. Uh, that's my the Twitter, the Instagram, the Snap. No, we're definitely going to throw that on there, pal. There goes the factsinitiative.com, Nodalege Radio, and Nodaledgemedia.com. All QR codes take you right to the site. Dope. Yeah, hit me up for some cars. I sent out cars all over, you know, all over boxes so you could pass them out. Um, the Mart 125th at Gmail is one of the Gmails. KTL Empowerment at Gmail is one of the Gmails. You know, um, get up, yeah, link and they up, can reach man, directly. Link, yeah, like, like I said, this year is gonna be a totally different way. We doing things different this whole year. We did, we can't do what we did this year. Next year or next solar, next cycle. My my year, my my cycle is my birthday. Mm -hmm. So I'm in my new year already. Mm -hmm. So. I'm doing newer things. I'm moving on. I'm growing. You know, I'm expanding. And you have to be able to do that. You don't want to look back and find yourself in the same place. Sky's the limit. So, you know, salute to everybody that's there. Once again, salute to my brother Polite. You know what I mean? Love and light to him and his family. Stay strong. Stay positive. And just know that everything happens for a reason. And there's light at the end of that tunnel. Salute. Peace. Back. Anthem on the track. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. King shit. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Look. I'm from the city where the bums rich. Skyscrapers block the rays when the sun hits. One time coming, niggas run quick. By the time a baby walk, he got a gun grip. I was made for this. 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 I'm not a product of the cages that they raised us in. Bred to be a king, I'm not a slave to this.